Welcome to Wings of Arrow Advanced Education and Research Organization. To know more, visit our official web page www.wingsofarrow.in. Find your dream aviation and aerospace jobs at www.wingsofarrow.in. Now we are going to learn how to find chamber pressure and nozzle area ratio of rocket engine. Consider an ideal rocket engine which is designed to operate at sea level using a propellant whose products of compression have a specific heat ratio of 1.3. Determine the required chamber pressure if the exit mark number is 2.52. Also determine the nozzle area ratio between the throat and exit. Here we consider a rocket engine. Given data. Specific heat ratio of combustion product K is equal to 1.3. An exit Mach number of rocket engine M2 is equal to 2.52. Now we have to find out the chamber pressure and nozzle area ratio between the throat and exit. Unlike the temperature, the stagnation pressure during an adiabatic nozzle expansion only remains constant for totally isentropic flows, that is, no losses of any kind. For optimum expansion, the nozzle exit pressure must equal the local atmospheric pressure. If the chamber velocity may be neglected, then the idle chamber pressure is the total stagnation pressure. Thus we can write P0 is equal to P into 1 plus 1 divided by 2 into K minus 1 into M square to the whole power K divided by K minus 1 where P0 is the chamber pressure which we have to find out and P is the atmospheric pressure which is 0 0.1013 mega pascal and K is the specific heat ratio and M is the Mach number of rocket engine. Now solve this equation with known values. We get sample pressure P0 is 1.84 mega pascal. Next find the nozzle area ratio. The nozzle area ratio for isentropic flow expressed in terms of Mach numbers for two arbitrary locations within the nozzle. From this, we can write the idle nozzle area ratio between exit area A2 and the throat area AT. So A2 divided by AT is equal to 1 divided by M2 into 1 plus K minus 1 divided by 2 into M2 square divided by k plus 1 divided by 2 to the whole power k plus 1 divided by 2 into k minus 1 where k is the specific heat ratio and m2 is the exit mark number. Now substitute the known values and simplify we get the required nozzle area ratio is 3.02. Note that idle implies no losses whereas optimum is a separate concept reflecting the best calculated performance at a particular set of given pressures optimum performance is often taken as the design condition did you know it's the world's most powerful operational rocket essentially three falcon 9 rockets strapped together a single Falcon 9 with two additional Falcon 9 first stages acting as boosters. The Falcon Heavy promises to bat aside the pesky conference of gravity like a giant swatting a fly. SpaceX hails it as the most powerful rocket in the world. And that's no exaggeration. In fact, it's the most powerful operational rocket in the world by a factor of two wasting more than 5 million pounds of thrust and it's the equivalent of 18747 airplanes firing at once. Its maiden flight will carry a fairly unusual payload. You know, Elon Musk is deadly serious about the success of his Falcon Heavy maiden flight, 
when he promises that its cargo will include his personal Tesla Roadster as a dummy payload. As Musk wrote on Twitter, the first Falcon Heavy's payload will be my midnight cherry Tesla Roadster plane space oddity. Destination is Mars orbit, will be in deep space for a billion years. Or so, if it does not blow up on ascent, we totally hope he is not kidding. At any rate, it beats firing monkeys and dogs into space. It is competitively priced. Everyone's idea of affordable is a bit different, but SpaceX is confident that the Falcon Heavy offers competitive pricing. A fully kitted out version will send you back $90 million on a standard payment plan. To reach for your blood, SpaceX will offer modest discounts although you will probably need to buy a few rockets to secure this or arrive at the showroom in a brand new Tesla Model X. If you have further inquiry or requested video, drop down to our mail wingsofarrow at the rate gmail.com. Don't forget to subscribe for more updates. For the time being, take care, stay blessed, inspired and fly high.